Madam Presiding Officer, Madam Presiding Officer, allow me also to, she's presiding over the elections. She may be returning office, I don't know whether she, she was gazetted or she gazetted herself, but I also want to take this opportunity to congratulate all members who have made it to the 13th Parliament. I know it was not easy, but having said that, allow me just to say one thing. Madam, Madam Presiding Officer, this matter, I think even if it may not be resolved today and we'll proceed and vote, it is something that the people of Kenya need to look at. At what point would an elected member be considered a member of parliament? By the time, that is your opinion, let me speak my opinion, I'm intelligent enough. Assuming office is not the same thing as being elected. The moment the returning officer in your electoral area pronounces you as elected, it is only the court of law. It is only the court of law which can reverse that decision. Whether you take oath of office or you don't take oath of office. Once you have been elected, pronounced as such, gazetted in the Kenya Gazette, as a senator, you become a senator elect. Whether there is elect after your name or the senator, it is still there. So this is a matter that cannot just be wished away. In fact, I think the people of Kenya made a mistake when we passed this constitution. You, there is a law, when you look at the constitution, just a minute, when you look at the constitution, Madam Chair, uh, Madam Presiding Officer, the constitution speaks to no one can be a member of parliament if you are a state officer, but goes ahead to exempt serving members of parliament from running, uh, for running. Now the same should have happened. I don't see why a sitting member of National Assembly cannot run for the office of the speaker and resign after Thank being you. elected. That is what happened in 2008 when Kenneth Otiato Marende was the MP for Emohaya. So if something is wrong in, with our laws, we need to accept it. Let us not speak, just take sides. You took an oath just a few minutes ago to protect this constitution. There is a problem in the constitution. We need to fix it. But as it is today, there is gray area. And therefore, Madam Presiding Officer, whether you let Honorable Moses Wetangula to run or not, the people of Kenya will have to deal with the elephant in the room that there is a problem with that provision of the law requiring requiring even sitting members of parliament to resign before they become the speaker of either house of parliament. I submit my case. Let us vote. Let us vote. Uh, th thank you very much, um, Acting Clerk. I I'd like to thank you. Thank you.